So guys welcome and today we are going to tackle a tree problem and the problem has asked us to find the maximum depth of a tree which means that we need to find the longest path of the tree to its farthest leaf node. Hope it makes sense. Let's see the logic behind it. Now as most of the time for this tree problem we are going to use the recursion method and we are going to recurse the left and the right section of the tree until a base condition is met and for this problem the base condition is true when we don't have a left and right node of a node but even if we have a single node at the right for example 3 of 9 then this won't be the base case and we won't return from this hope it makes sense and we are also going to keep track of the depth we are going inside the left or right section for this example at first we are going to start the height with a zero value and as most of the time we are going to recurse the left part of the tree and we are going from here to here and our length will be one and in this node as we don't have left or we also don't have the right node we are going to return out from this but with adding 1 to the value of it. We have returned out of this node with 2 height. And we are going to travel the right side of the tree by adding 1 onto it. As this node has left and right part, we are going to add 2 onto it and we have reached here. And this node neither has a right or left node. That's why we are going to return out with 3 value. And after this section, we are going to this section. And as this node also don't have left or right node, we are going to return out of this with 3 value. We can take either this or this. It does not matter. And we are going to pass this to the calling function. This and this will be passed. We are going to check which of these is greater. And at last, the 3 answer is written back. Let's see the code example for this. So guys, this is the solution for that problem. And you can see that we have inserted the same example value in this function. And we are going to do the housekeeping by checking if the root value is null. If that, then we are going to return zero. If not, then we are going to call the helper recursion method. And in that we are going to pass the root node with initial value initial height value as 0. We are going to set the base case if left and right are null then we are going to increment 1 onto that accumulated value and we are going to return it. If not then we are going to set two variables left max and right max from which we are going to check which of these is greater and we are going to traverse left if left node is not null and right if right not no if right node is not null and we are going to set that outcome into that left and right max value these two will be yielding the depth of each of its side and we are at last checking left and right which of these is greater and if left is greater then we are going to return left and if not then we are going to return the right max value hope it makes sense GitHub link is provided in the description section. Thank you guys.